Oh, well, who told them? Who told them what? That they'll be filling the toilet with Cullen Spring bottles. Well, who did that? What? The man who made a duty. The man who made a duty. I know, we're on. Oh, great. So we're, see. we're bringing you the man who made a duty. At the duty free shop. Okay, let's sing this one. Duty free, duty foo, duty fra. What are these fucking microphones doing? Yeah, what? Four? I I Did she have four guests or something? Three guests? Did we have enough mics? Yeah, there's a mic pack. We finally had enough. Do you, you have to bring mics from Willie's place? No. We only found out about the last minute. Oh, well, somebody was supposed to call you guys. Yeah, well... <laughs> the, the, the communication in this My fucking God, joint... It's popping. Hot, hot, hot! The fucking... Hot! hot. It's popping. <laughs> Look at the bullshit here. No, 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 no. Why do you want to go back? Do you want to go back? Yeah. 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 Put all this shit. My mother put all this shit. Me. Uh, there he is. <laughs> Me. I paid off all this crap. And the fire too. Fire. I need a haircut. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a. You just got a haircut. Oh, it's over here on this side. I, who just got a haircut? Did you just get a haircut? But I got a haircut. four or five weeks ago, he got a haircut. Yeah, yeah. Why don't Why don't we have my barber come and Lance? Lance, but I remember. Did I have Did I ever have a haircut on the show? No. I'm I'm talking 25 years ago, 30 years ago, not 30, but 25 anyhow. Enough of that shit. It's good shit, but it's salty and fechy. It's it's fechy and salty. It's 160 calories an hour. Journey to the unknown. <laughs> Holding spring to, to to flush a toilet. Fucking twelve dollars a flush. Okay, we see what kind of day this is. Is gonna be. Since our audience can't remember from one day to the next, you might want to consider putting up a fucking phone number. Grub's Tube, May 29, 2008, 604-9500. What's going on with the Mets? They were leading 8-4 at the end of 7, I believe. At the end of 7, the Mets were up. Orange Jack. For Jay Horowitz. Or Jay Harwitz. I'm, I'm not sure. I don't think it's Harwitz. It's Harwitz. 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 Yeah, he's been the, the PR guy for maybe 25 years there or something. Never. Did never. Just one person have to wear it, or did he have to wear it? No, it was him. I think. It was him. <coughs> Shane Tano, I said. Yes. Arranged that. Well, it was a dream or something. He had his thing. He had to wear it. I don't have a dream. It says incoming call, but nothing's ringing over anywhere. We don't know anything. Has the, has the ringer side turned off? Yeah, turned off. The ringer's turned off? No, not that. We don't hear it here. We don't hear anything here. It's not supposed to ring out here. What? It's not supposed to ring over here. Never rings out here? It's not supposed to ring in the A studio. That's so not acceptable. Can we make it acceptable? No. No, we cannot make it acceptable. Can we change the tone at least and go pop, 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 pop? You know. <laughs> is, is that the Wizard of Evens or the Wizard of Odds? That's the Wizard of Not Contention. Your <laughs> review. The Wizard of. Uh, Am I accustomed to not hearing ringing anywhere? I, that's that sounds different to me. I mean, it's that, ringing in the control room as usual. But, but. Apparently you turned it down then. We can hear him. I was gonna try and throw it Because I'm a, I'm accustomed to hearing ringing with some veracity to it. Veracity ringing. Much better. <laughs> <laughs> now 
All right, you can turn it off. I am. I'm being. I'm being. I'm being dissed. It's doing that weird ringing where like all the rings are con conjunction with each other. It's sort of like a synergy, an astrological alignment where there's no end to the ring. It just goes on forever and ever in a maddening uh, barrage of horrible beeping sounds. It's well, driving me nuts. The question is, is, you is, nuts. is, the question is listening to you describe it is driving the rest of us nuts. What do you want? Say, I answer and then stop out there. What the fuck is going on? That's it. Nobody's there. I thought you were supposed to stop calling. I thought you were supposed to stop calling. What? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to talk. I'm going to talk. I'm going to talk to somebody with the te with the television on, so I can hear myself twice, three times, bouncing around off you. Turn your fucking. Would you put up a big fucking sign on the thing? Turn your fucking TV sound down. I said, and then I'm eating. What the fuck do I know? You think I talk to myself? Oh, yeah. oh thanks. They, they, they went away. Oh, there's one. There's one. Hello? Yes. Hi. You hung up on me earlier. What do you mean earlier? Just a second ago. You hung up on me. Well, I didn't do it purposely because, you know, I would have to know who you are for me to hang up on you. And a voice like yours, I don't hang up on so fast. Oh, that's sweet. What are you eating? Popcorn. Okay. The fattening kind or the regular kind? Which kind? The fattening kind or the regular kind? Well, it doesn't look like I'm on a major diet here with this stuff. <laughs> it's 90% salt. Oh, really? Where are you from with this accent? I'm South African. Oh, and how old are you, if I may ask? 29. 29. Uh, okay. What do you? I, yeah. This is new to me. I'm actually, I'm actually here on holiday. Uh, what? What? Yeah. Is your uh, is your currency worth a lot more here also lately, or it's not? <laughs> actually, it stayed the same. Seven point five rand to the dollar. That's been that way for a long time. Yeah. Okay. Fluctuated a bit, but. So what? What do you do in South Africa? You were from Johannesburg, or what? I'm an accountant in Cape Town. Cape Town. Okay. What do you do there? I'm an auditor. Oh, oh I didn't hear. I didn't. Hear. Well, I didn't hear. Give me what? That. Okay. You, you audit. Yeah. And when you find out that people are stealing, what happens? Oh, uh, it's actually quite depressing. What do you say? Something about prison. Prison. It's depressing, because I wouldn't want to be caught either. Uh, but, but you have to let other people know that you have found stuff. Yeah, but everybody's stealing, so then it's kind of sad when you catch that one person, you know, because it's uh, what, what, you, you seems mean, a little unfair. You mean, in, in other words, if you did an audit and everything seemed to be okay, you still figure they're stealing? Right. I'd love to audit the government, though. Yeah. Are you auditing private companies or auditing... Right. Yeah. Right. It's private. And you should actually get Skype on this. That would be awesome. Get what? Skype. Spell it. S-K-Y-P-E. Oh, Skype. Skype. Skype phone, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so you, you came to New York for your holiday? Right. I'm actually on honeymoon. No. You know, on, uh, during a honeymoon, you're supposed to be having sex. <laughs> We're married now, so we have more sex. <laughs> How long have you been married? <laughs> um, actually, two months ago. Two months so. ago. So, so you read the manual that says as soon as you get married, that the sex is over? Right, right. You believe it? Well, she's, she wrote the book. <laughs> well, congr Whee! congratulations. What does he do? Uh, back home, he's actually retired. <laughs> you, you married an old man? Right. Well, no. Um, he's an investor, private investor. An investor? Right. Another crook. So investor or inventor? I beg your pardon? He, he wants to know if you said inventor or investor. Investor in real estate. Ah, he's a real investor. estate investor. Made a lot of money. Do you live in a lovely house? Yes.